Hello everybody, J Lukey here. Today we are opening up a Pokemon Twilight Masquerade Booster Box. Let's get into this. Um, I opened up one before. We did end up getting an alternate art out of it, so hopefully more of the same in today's video. Although I don't want a bummy Ogapon like I got last time. Something like a Greninja or maybe a... Um, oh, there's about... There's like a million trainer art rares in this set that are actually pretty good. Um, and the Blood Moon Ursa Lunar Alt Art as well, I would like. As well as the um, Eevee Art Rare. So there's quite a few cards that I would uh, like. So um, hopefully we can get at least one in this video. I mean, that's a lot to ask for um, an Alt Art and especially one of the top tier ones. But uh, let's get this popped up. This Blood Moon Ursa Lunar is not wanting to... There we go. Look at that. Looking nice. 36 packs. Let's do this. Hopefully we can actually get some good cards. Um, I mean, I would just like to get um, that EV Art Rare. That's probably the only Art Rare that I really want. Um, I'm pretty sure there are some others that I would like to get. Um, but I just... Don't know the set list that well. I know there is a Carmine, a really nice Carmine. And, just talking about it, an Applin in our first pack. I don't know if I've already got this or not. I'm sorry, I'm just adjusting the camera. But an Applin, to get things started off with, I will 100% take that. Um, But yeah, how are you guys enjoying Twilight Masquerade? Um... Leave a comment, leave a like, leave a subscribe. Um, I don't ask too much for subscribes, but um, or oh, for people to subscribe, if I can talk properly. But I would really appreciate it. We are less than 100 subs off of 500, which is massive. Um, that might not seem like a lot for, to some people, but 500 subs, it's quite a few people quite a few people um i did end up getting over forty thousand views um all together on my channel um a couple of days ago so you know it's been on the up and up really we have a dreepy cramorant we have a sunflora venipede we have a clefairy and an iron leaves hollow um if you guys don't know why i'm taking the pack off the screen my arm is still not a hundred percent yet um, so I'm having to pretty much do everything with my left hand. Trust me, I'm not doing anything suspect. We have a Heracross. We have a Palafin. We have a Volbeat. Jinx. And an Infernape. Damn! We've gotten nothing except for that first, um, art rare. I'm just gonna zoom in just a little bit. But, um, yeah. Other than art rare, we've literally gotten nothing so far, so... Hopefully that can change. I'm going to do it like this. We have a Palisand. We have a Spinarak. Hisuian Growlithe. We have a Poliwag. Belly Bolt. Snorlax. Lana's A. That's another really nice art rare that's in the set as well. And an Enamorous. Jeez. We are getting actually nothing. What is it? Like six packs? One pull? Come on. I know. I did see... Um, a lot of people talk about how this set is kind of uh, kind of brutal. Um, but come on, I think I see something in this pack. I don't know if that's in the reverse slot or in the rare. I think this might be a normal EX coming up here. We have an Abra. And we have a Teal Mask Ogapon. Is it this Ogapon that's worth like 13 bucks? I think it is. I think it is the grass one. So I will definitely take that. Ogapon EX. Yeah, I think it's worth it, worth something ridiculous, like ten dollars. Um, yeah, I'll take that. Alrighty, next pack up we have a Timber, we have a Spinarak, Sandshrew, Perrin, we have a Cramorant, we have a Floet, and speak of the devil, we just get another Ogapon. All right, come on, please. Give us a good alt art. I actually don't know the last time that I didn't get an alt art out of the booster box. I've kind of been on a good streak when it comes to booster boxes and getting alt arts. Even though they're not guaranteed anymore um, in these newer sets. I know in like Scarlet and Violet Base and stuff like that. And like Obsidian. Um, they were guaranteed. But in like Paradox Rifts. 
um, and this set, they've been kind of hard to get. Um, even in Paldea Evolve, I'm pretty sure they had, um, a guaranteed alt art in every box, so... It is kind of interesting, um, to see. And I mean, it makes hunting the cards way, like, better and way more difficult. Um, honestly, I like hunting the cards, but then again, I don't want to go through, like, three boxes and not get a single alt art, or I get, like, a bummy alt art, and that's what I'm stuck with after spending, like, $600 on cards. Um, but I mean, it feels, feels, you feel more accomplished, Glaceon Reverse, and you have a Palafin EX. But yeah, as I said, you feel more, like, just feel better about yourself when you pack, like, a like an alt art in these later sets. I mean, like, for me personally, I've packed a Roaring Moon alt art multiple times, so not really, um, not really too hyped, but I think I just got very lucky, so, you know. I do like seeing alt arts. Um, I do like packing them, so hopefully we can get some. We have a Conkelda, Slugma. Oh, we have a Torkoal Art Rare. You know what? That is a really nice Art Rare. I'm glad that I got that. Torkoal Art Rare. I'll take that. We've got two Art Rares and two EXs. Um, we should start to see some Ace spec cards, or at least a Full Art coming up here soon, or something like that. Um, I think there are guaranteed a spec cards for a box, so hopefully we can get one. Um, the Eevee as well, I said at the start of the video, Eevee Art Rare would be a, a really good card to get. We have a Lampence and a Chandelure, straight up Evolved. But yeah, a, um, Eevee Art Rare, that would also be, like, if I didn't get an alt art, but I got an Eevee Art Rare, I think that's like, what, that's like a top three Art Rare in the, um, Scarlet and Violet era. Um, I'm seeing that card go, like, oh, I don't even know. I thought it was going for over 50 bucks. We have a Conkelda. We have a Ogre's Mask. We have a Helioptile, Sandy Ghast, and a Ting Lu. We're, um, I think we're a little under halfway through the box. I don't really keep count of the packs, considering there are 36. But, um... Come on, let's uh, let's see something good. Um, and I think the last two booster boxes we opened, I actually got a gold and a alt art in each box. So um, yeah, if I get a gold and an alt art each box, I will be very happy with that. But currently, not looking the best. I mean, two art rares, two EXs, and geez, almost halfway through the box, it's not looking too good so far. We have a Froki, Eevee, Phantom. We have a Sunflora, we have a Glalie, Morpeko, Halucha, and another Ogre Pond. Damn! This is harsh. I didn't think it'd be... I didn't think Twilight Masquerade would be this harsh. This, this like, second half of the box has to be, like, crazy. We have a Corfish, Grookey. We have a Finzen. We have a Palafin, Shiyu. Pinsa, I see something... I think I see something in the back. No, I don't. Sinistia, damn. Sinistar, actually. Sinistia, or whatever. I literally can't say half these Pokemon's names anymore. I'm getting too old. I miss the I miss the olden days where it was the um, Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire remake and X and Y. And black and white. Um, there is definitely something in this pack. Please. Please let this be an all. Oh! Legacy Energy Ace Spec. That is... That's a pretty nice Ace Spec. Um, I don't have, like... I don't know the prices or the rarity on these. This is also... Oh, I was going to say off-centered, but I think that's just how the front looks. I don't really... Yeah, they're just, like, two really skinny borders, but that just might be how it is. I don't really pay attention to the Ace Spec cards that often, but... We got an ace spec. I was talking about it before and we've gotten it. Um, I think on average there's two ace spec cards per box. So I think we might be in for one more. Um, now we're just looking for a full art. I mean, we haven't gotten a full art yet. We have a Mytiana. Iron Bundle. We have a Jamming Tower. 
Crawdunce, and a Monkey Dory. Wow. This is quite a harsh box. All things considered, what? Five pulls, three of them were EXs. And I mean, yeah, we are definitely like 15 packs in. More probably. We have a Flabebe. We have a Timber. We have a Belly Bolt. I see a shine at the back of these packs, and I never know if it's the hollow or something. Oh, we do have a pincer. That is actually, I'll just take that. That is actually a really nice art rare. I I quite enjoy that artwork. That is that is a fun artwork. Kind of off-centered off top to bottom. It looks like there's some weird stuff happening up top. I don't know if you can see, but there's like... I don't know if you can see, but there is like some dents up the top. You might be able to see it on the back, but... There is definitely something. But Pinsa, I will definitely take that. It's a nice art rare. The fact that we have more art rare pulls than EXs, EX pulls so far, it's pretty odd. Um, yeah, three art rares, one Aspect and one, um, uh, two, two EXs, I should say. All right. We have a Trevenant. We have an Amolga. We have a Brute Bonnets. We have a Kawatrol, some Flora, we have a Chimchar, and a Heatran. Damn, we haven't gotten any full arts yet. We need to get some full arts. Preferably the full art trainers from this set, I think, are the way to go. Um, that Carmine. The Carmine alt art is so cool. Um, dude, the... This is probably the... It's... It's tied. I reckon it's close between this and Paldea Evolve for some of the best um, trainer alt arts. Because there are some fun ones. We have a Arcanine. And we do have a Greninja EX. Hopefully we can get the alt art version of this. That is the top pull for the set. But a Greninja EX there. We have, um, we have over 10 packs left. I think we've got about 15. Maybe more, maybe less. I really uh, I really don't know at this point. We have an Applin, Nosepass, Sea King, Sunkern, Glalie. We have a Probopass. We have a Chimeco. And an Alakazam. Jeez, we are... Wow. There has to be some crazy, like... Crazy pulls coming up, because... No full arts, no golds yet, or alt arts, or any type of secret rare. Um, I actually think, oh yes, I do see purple or pink, I just don't know. Um, I think there might be something in this. Probably an ace bet, yep. Scoop up Cyclone, I believe I already have that, but I will take another one, I guess. Scoop up Cyclone, I will sleeve that. So there are our two ace bet cards, so... Before getting full arts or secret rares or an alt art, we have gotten three art rares. Just weird. Usually I, um, yeah, weird that I haven't even seen a full art yet. I don't know if, um, these new gen boxes, um, like, don't have as many full arts as I would have thought. We have a Darrow Marker. We have an Apom. We have a... A, a pom again. Was that the same card, or am I tripping? Oh no, that was the evolution. We have an EV reverse, Kadabra, and we do have a Blissey EX. Very nice. Come on. Yeah, we. I don't know. Just in my experience, we get like what about three to four full arts in a box. And we haven't seen any, and it's we're, we are over two thirds of the way through this, so um, we should be starting to see something. We should get our secret rare of the box. Um, we have an Abra, we have a Polyrath, Scolipede, we have a Community Center, and an Arcanine. Yeah, we should be starting to see some um, a lot of hits soon. I mean, this box has been pretty decent. We've gotten, like, what's expected of a box so far. Just very odd. 
might just be uh, back heavy. We have a Probopass, Love Ball, we have an Amolga, we have a Vulpix, and a Zapdos. All right. Very interesting. I wonder if the A spec cards replace full arts and uh, golds. I haven't thought about that. I don't think they do. I think I'm just not getting lucky. We have a Clefable, Sunkern, we have a Feebas. Well, there's our first one, Greninja EX Full Art. That is a actually a pretty decent Full Art to get, the Greninja EX. Nice, I'll take that. I don't know how much it costs, but it's a nice card I can add to my collection. We've got nine packs left, I believe, if you include this one. All right, we have an Abra, Snorunt, Chimeco, Chimchar, Heracross, Love Ball, Glamora, Trevenant, Chirafarig, and Walking Wake. You know what would be cool? I've gotten the um, Terrestrialized Greninja, and I've gotten the Greninja EX Normal. Can we, um, can we get one more different Greninja in this um, box? That'd be pretty nice. We have a Timber, Spinarak, we have a Growlithe. Poliwag, we have a Belly Bolt, we have an Applin, Timber, and a Chandelure. Come on. Please. If this box goes without any more, like, decent pulls, I'm going to be very upset. We have a Snorlax, Clefable... And we do have a Macargo EX. So there should be our last EX, I would assume. And then maybe one more Art Rare and maybe one or two more Full Arts. And hopefully we get uh, either a good Gold card or, like, you know, a decent Secret Rare. We have a Snorunt. Bug Catching Set. Apom. We have a Kieran, Nine Tails, and we do get a Full Art Trainer. It's not one of the ones that I would have liked, probably like a $1 or $2 trainer, but, um, you know, it is what it is. I'm optimistic that we will at least get a good alternate art. Please, come on. We have a Area Dose, Slurpuff. Poltergeist, Finzen, and a Zapdos. We have four more packs left. Am I right? We've got four. One, two, three, four. Yep, four more packs. Come on. This is going down to the wire. If we if we do something like if we get like a crazy like top three alt art out of one of these last packs, I'm gonna be quite stoked. Um we have a Ducklet, a Mulga, we have a Growlithe. Ooh, what is that in the back? Oh, please. I hate these holographics trolling me. We have a Heracross. Far out. I'm, I hate this so much. It's the one thing that I hate about this era is I sw you swear you see an extra sparkle at the back, but it's just these bummy hollows. They're, it's like the Pokemon Company Incorporated just laughing in our faces. We have a Pinsir. We have a Gerda. Cook. Clefable, Tatsuguru, a Swing Growlithe, and an Iron Thorns EX. We have two packs left and we're packing EXs, normal EXs. This may possibly be the worst box I've opened, but we've got two packs left. You know, as long as there are packs on the table, there are chances for us to get goated cards. Come on, please. Surely since it's been like a pretty not good box, there's going to be a crazy alt art. Clefairy. Melodic. Come on. We have a Frogadier. <laughs> oh my god. If we do not go... I think this might be the first... Um, opening 
in probably the history of our channel where if we don't get anything out of this packet, this is going to be the first opening that I haven't gotten at least like a gold or a, a secret rare out of our last pack or at least out of our box in general. Come on, please. Please, I'm begging you. Please. Or an EVR rare. Please. Or Blood Moon Ursa Luna. I mean, it's on the front. Please. Oh, do you see that? I, oh, I hate this. No. We have a slurp off. Please don't make history for the wrong thing. This is the worst. That was the worst box I have ever opened in my entire life. Jesus Christ. Sorry if um you get offended by me saying that, but these are our two full arts. We get one, two, three, four. Four EXs, five EXs. We get three art rares. Or no, we I don't even know. I am outraged by that, honestly. One, two, three, four, five, six. Normal EXs. That bummy trainer. An all right full art. Only three art res. Um, and two, I... Dude. Unless I'm, like, missing something. Unless I, like... Yeah. I'm just trying to cope now. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. That's made J. Lukey history for the wrong reason. I'll see you in the next one. J. Lukey out.